Yo, 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 what is up, everybody? Welcome back to another video. Today, we are going to talk about the patch notes 9.0 and the introduction, the beautiful, the beautiful introduction to uh, ranked Valorant into co the console port. Okay, so let's get right into the patch notes and we'll talk about what's going on basically tomorrow. Just a disclaimer, there's certain patch notes that won't be added until later, I believe on the 1st of July or the first week of July sometime for the console port. Okay. For the PC, everything here is, I'm assuming it's going to be kind of like a Call of Duty settings in the old days where it's like the first week or the first two weeks, PlayStation gets it while the Xbox and PC crowd gets it like one or two weeks later. Okay, so let's get right into the patch notes. So all platforms, agent updates, new voice lines, which we love. That's a big W. Always, always love team building <laughs> voice lines. They're always hilarious. ISO, we've already went over the ISO updates uh, and for the for his nerfs, basically just a small recap from the other video. Duration from 20 seconds to 12 seconds, W. Signature kill reset removed, W. Okay. So meaning the time limit uh, what on, the, on the bar meter or whatever it's called is now from 20 to 12 and the signature kill reset, that means after two kills, you don't get it back. Okay. It's a one and done ability. Okay. For console, Sova's Owl drone HP is now now up to 100, up from 60, okay? Big big W. Now, this is where it gets a little confusing, just a bit on the patch notes. Uh, I think maybe it's just a typo, or maybe it's just a communication problem. But at the current moment, Abyss is being added to the ranked map pool. However, we don't know if it's for console. However, just two bullet points down below. It says, our competitive mode... We'll be starting with Abyss, Ascent, Bind, Haven, and Sunset. Well, this is weird because Abyss says it's being added here, but it's also not, but it's also not said that it's being added up here. So it's a little confusing. I th I guess Abyss is being added to the ranked version of the console for console, but uh, I don't know. I I don't know yet. Okay. Um, and also ranked is being added for con <laughs> console. If you didn't get that. Uh, gameplay systems updates, huge W. Added new control preset selection screen upon first boot up. For, uh, prior between the tutorial, you can choose between balance specific controls preset or more traditional FPS preset. I would recommend going with, honestly, it's up to you. I actually don't use any of them. I use a, a different other one. Okay, that's just me personally. Uh, polished sound transitions between focus and ADS better reflect the aim state that you're transitioning to. Good. Crosshair presets now have been updated to reflect a bit better variety of usable crosshairs. Updated the fighter controls presets so the crouch has a hold action. Noise. Added holistic aim sensitivity slider. Noise. Precision mode added to the sliders. Noise. Also, big update. Big update, okay? This uh, for controls and especially for aim, they kind of cleaned up the sensitivity stuff. Okay, they kind of went with a Call of Duty approach. So your base sensitivity is right there. So it's your aim sensitivity going left, right. Okay, it's just four. Okay. However, if you want to do a more deep dive version, you will turn on advanced sensitivity settings, and then you can have a huge breakdown. Okay, so it disables the aim sensitivity above. And it breaks down the rest into like base into horizontal and vertical. You can now do a focus again. Like there's nothing like big or nothing changed. They're just cleaning up the menu. Okay. So if you're asking where the hell are my advanced sensitivity settings? Well, it's right there. Okay. So I believe you do have to turn them on. Okay. Don't quote me on this, but I believe you do. Okay. Uh, PC stuff, blah, blah, blah. People being toxic, blah, blah, blah. Who isn't toxic in this game, to be honest? Social updates. We have updated the communications menu so it's easier to manage teams and party voice on the fly. We've added voice chat to the settings page. Now you can tailor your mic behavior and voice settings to suit your setup. Again, huge W. Fixing, adding stuff for social stuff. Always a great W. Uh, for console bug fixes, uh, fix an issue with Jet's tailwind reduce uh, that was reducing the dash length. W Jet's now better. Always W. Uh, no neon apparently. Uh, no neon fix yet, but I know a lot of you neon mains are uh, a bit annoyed by that. 
For console, fix an issue in Team Deathmatch where you would incorrectly see a draw at the final result of the EOG screens. Add a specific scoreboard scenes for the Team Deathmatch and Deathmatch. Okay. Gameplay systems uh, for all. Uh, Got to fix those skins. Okay. We fix an issue with one of the skins, the Mystic Bloom Collection. Uh, fix an issue exiting Cypher spy cam that caused Cypher's hands to stutter for spectators. Okay. W. W spectator. Console. Fix an issue where both focus and ADS sounds were playing during transition. Okay. Fix the leave, men uh, leave game menu persisting through AFK idling. Okay. Fix animation bug with leave game menu. Okay. Uh, Abyss for some map fixes. Uh, undetended boost positions been fixed. Bugs getting people underneath the map fixed. Omen and Astra Smoke now properly appearing on the A site. Good. I, this, I've never actually seen this one, but this is hilarious. Fix an issue where Omens was aligned to get between spawn barriers. That is hilarious. Uh, social. Fix an issue where the friends list would sometimes disappear in inaccurate platform information for friends. W. They love fixes like those. Okay, known issues for console. When navigating surrender menus, there's a chance your controls can become locked for an entire round. Due to this, we have elected to disable the surrender and remake menus until we can properly fix the issue. Draw will remain functional. Actually, you should just take out the surrender portion. Remakes are fine. I understand remakes. And people who don't know what remakes are is if somebody goes AFK after the first round, you are able to actually hit that surrender slash remake button that's in the menu to remake the game so it's more fair because it's not fair for the people who are 4v5s. You will not get punished if you ever remake in a game. Okay? This goes for ranks. So I guess they're disabling it for now. Uh, For Premiere... Okay, that's for PC. Okay. So let's get into the juicy stuff, okay? How does Valorant rank works, okay? And we'll say this right now. Valorant rank works like a couple other like games where first, to prevent boosters, Valorant has introduced a, your account must be level 20, okay? Luckily for me, I don't have to worry about it because <laughs> my account is over 200. So, suckers. <laughs> okay, so your first account has to be over level uh, 20. And there's a quick tip. Bike Rush is the quickest way to level up, okay? Unranked for the first five games for placement. Okay, that's very common. Your first five games you're unranked they're trying to get you to see how well you're doing your games um it does take place into it does take uh performance into place but majority of it is about wins okay however i'm just saying your rank resets each act play five placements for new episode and one placement for acts two and three okay so if you don't know if you're new to valorant each episode has three acts within it okay it's as simple as that okay after three acts there's a new episode you got new some cool ass cinematics and all that fun stuff okay new agents uh new changes to the game new maps usually per act i believe every other act there's usually either a new map or a new agent that's what i've seen so far like so recently it's just been abyss so next thing you know, next act, we're probably going to get a new hero or, uh, sorry, agent. Also, once you finish your first five completed, um, re I guess your ranked, re oh, sorry, your placement matches, the max initial placement is ascended, okay? That is huge. Before, when people didn't play this game, uh, Ascendant actually, when this first game came out, Ascendant was never actually a thing. They incorporated Ascendant because too many people were uh, becoming immortals and stuff on PC. And it, well, it makes sense. So they wanted to level it out more. Okay. So, well, first things first, uh, we got iron, uh, you got bronze, you got silver, gold, plat, diamond, Ascendant, immortal, radiant. Okay. Now, I don't think it shows you in any of the photos. The way to boost up into these ranks is, first of all, if you draw or if you remake, okay, it is automatically zero, okay? Automatically zero. However, if you have a good performance and stuff, you might get like three extra 
R, uh, rank, sorry, RP, okay? So when I say RP, it means rank point, okay? Next, each subsection is 100 points, okay? So from iron one to iron two, iron three is goes iron one to two hundred. So iron one to two is one hundred. The two to three is one hundred, and three to bronze one is one hundred. Okay. However, most games are around two twenty RP to eighteen. It really depends on your performance. This is where your performance kicks in. So like a good RP game would probably be around twenty four, twenty five. Have a bad one you might lose i've i've seen i've lost 26 rp on a really bad game i had on pc so it can like mostly you'll be around 20 but depending on performance you'll either be less or more okay and also i believe for radiant i believe it is the top i want to say 150 i'm not 100 percent sure off the top of my head it might be like 250 i can't remember it's been so long however that's what we're aiming for on this channel okay so that is it for everything guys if you have any more questions actually just hit me up on this my link or sorry my stream i'm about to be streaming today so hit that like and subscribe down below if you liked the patch notes 9.0 don't be afraid to hit that like and subscribe. And we'll see you next time. Say hello into the stream. Peace out. Have a good night. This took me at least five times to record. <laughs> so have a good night, everybody.